Are you around? Hello? Hey, answer me! I'm up. Did you find Hunter last night? Quit yelling at me. I'm, I'm not. I'm talking normal. You're yelling in my head. Did you find Hunter? <sighs> yeah, I did. Didn't get much out of him, though. But you got something. Yeah. A headache. I meant Hunter. <laughs> Very little, but I got something. Look, I'm starving. It's ten in the morning. It's ten. I gotta hurry. Where are you at? I'm still in my room. I didn't get back until three this morning. Why so late? Uh, I'll fill you in later. I, <laughs> I stink and I'm starving. Everybody's got some ties and some lows But all that matters is how you deal with it all I hope you realize this all with time Just take control of the thoughts inside your head And understand that what you think is what you get I'll dream big, just watch me get what's mine <laughs> Okay, I'm back. Where are you going? I told you, I need to get something to eat. Okay, what do I want? Good morning, sir. What can I get you to drink? Coffee, please. Here is a menu. I'll go get that coffee for you. What can I get you? Uh, I'll just take two eggs and some sausage and some wheat toast. And how would you like your eggs? Over easy, please. Coming right away, sir. Can you get me a coffee? I'm going to use the bathroom. Sure. I'll grab us a table. Thanks. Oh, nice to see you here. Becky, how are you doing? I'm okay. I'm surprised to see you again. Yeah, I, I just haven't left yet. I know the feeling. Can I start you off with a drink? Two coffees, please, to start. Coming right up. Should I ask who the person is you came in with? Oh, it's just Travis's brother, Jackson. Makes no difference to me, I'm not a judge. Hello, I'm Jackson Clark. I don't believe we've had the pleasure of meeting. Nice to meet you, Jackson. I know Becky from the restaurant. I'm the local bank manager in the area. Are you from around here? No, I'm just passing through, but I'll keep it in mind if I ever decide to stay. I'll leave you guys alone. Uh, here is your coffee, everyone. Your food will be ready soon. Uh, are you two ready to order? I am. Becky, are you ready? I think I'll have a ham and cheese omelet and hash browns. I'll take uh, oatmeal, please. Anything else, sir? Nope. Not unless it's free. Coming right up. So, Becky, I have some news on Travis. He's at the ranch. How is he? Has he said anything? He has opened up a little bit, but we're still trying to get him to talk. He misses you. He talks about you a lot. Here is your food, sir. Has he said what is wrong yet? What happened when he was captured? 
I don't know everything, but can you imagine being held prisoner for a year and a half, watching your whole group die in front of your eyes, and not, not being able to do anything? I don't know what he did on most of his missions. He would tell me enough for me to know not to ask. I thought you guys talked about everything. We wouldn't talk about that. I promised him when we got married that I would never ask. I never knew that. I'm hoping there is a lot about Travis and I that you don't know. He didn't tell me everything. Some, he always said, were only meant for you. Glad to know. Uh, here is your omelet, ma'am, and here is your oatmeal, sir. Can I get you anything else? A uh, refill? No, thank you. I think we are good right now. Have you been able to talk to him alone yet? Not yet. Plan on taking him for a walk in the woods soon. He is not a dog, Jackson. You don't take him for a walk. If anything, he'll take you. So, I'm a dog? How's your oatmeal? <laughs> it's good, it's good. Um, you know, he might talk to Hunter before I get a chance. I think they're going hunting tomorrow. Isn't Hunter always hunting? Not with a gun. Well... You know what I mean. <laughs> I do. So, do you think he wants to see me or the kids yet? I still think it would be best if we wait a little longer. I hope it's not too much longer. I miss him. I miss my brother. Can I get a refill? No charge, right? Oh, no charge at all. How about you, sir? I'll take a refill and the check, please. You know what? Give me theirs, too. You don't have to do that. Quiet, Becky. Let the man pay. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. I'm more than happy to. Well, thank you. Let me know if there is anything I can do for you. I'll think of something, but it's really no big deal. Here is your refills. Thank you. Thank you. Look, Becky, I should be getting back. I understand. Thank you for meeting me here. I'll talk to him. And then I'll get back with you. Please hurry. I'll talk to him. Thank you again for paying. It's no problem. Yes, it is. Jackson would have never let it go if he had paid. I know. Travis told you a lot, didn't he? Well, not enough, if you ask me. He's not that hard to understand. Well, it's like putting a puzzle together, but you're given one piece at a time. A puzzle with many pieces. And no edges. <laughs> I can see why he talked with you. Why's that? You listen. Well, to be honest, he taught me that. He is a good teacher. I think he's good at a lot of things, but it's one thing that you're missing. Should I ask what that is? Loving on you. I thought you were going to say something else, but yes, that is the one thing I miss the most. Becky, I, I hate to do this, but I need to get going. 
I understand. I have to get going too. It's a pleasure running into you again. It's nice to have an adult conversation every now and then. What about Jackson? I said adult. <laughs> I read you loud and clear. Maybe I'll run into you again. I would love to know what Travis told you. I'm still trying to understand most of it myself, but yes, if we meet again, I'll share what he said. Thank. Have a good day. I'm paying these both. Uh, no problem, sir. Let me add these up. It's 2156. Hold on. I'm adding all the numbers. Okay, so that is 2156. But I guess you already knew that. Here's 30. Keep the change. Thank you. You around? What happened? I forgot to put the earpiece back in. Anything exciting happen? I just had breakfast with Becky and Jackson. Do they know anything? No, they're clueless. Good. Well, this day's shot. Might as well go back to the room and sleep more. I was planning that anyways. It's not like you to take a day off. I didn't take it off. I just haven't shared it with you. Well, uh, whatever. All right. I'm going back to the room. I'll do some work tomorrow. Till next time, everyone. You know you're not a DJ, right? I like to pretend. That's, that's what people know me here as. One day, they will know the truth. It'll be too late by then. Till tomorrow. What's next? Who knows? Who cares?